Good afternoon, good evening, depending on where you are in the world. Welcome to another episode of everybody's favorite show, Austin Show in the Tub. In the Tub with Austin Show. And I'll be your host this evening for what is set to be one of my favorite guests, one of my favorite people of all time, uh, entering this tub. Now, before we introduce our wonderful guest, I want to say, you may notice we are in a new location. The whole intention of this show was that we would travel around and discover new people's bathrooms and have an intimate conversation in a place in which they bathe. A lot of you speculated that we may be again in Ms. Kiff's tub, but I am proud to report we are in a new location. We are in none other than Ludwig's bathtub. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. And it's an absolute beauty. Before, again, before I introduce, I wanna say something. This is not a sexual show, okay? It's not a sexual show. So please, would you refrain from the objectification of me and my guest throughout the course of this show, okay? Please, we don't like you to talk about our bodies. So please refrain. Ladies and gentlemen, without further ado, welcoming him to his own bathtub, ladies and gentlemen, give it up for Ludwig. Get on in. Hey, you got some, you got some room? All right, I got some room. Welcome aboard. Welcome into the bathtub, Mr. Ludwig. Your body looks fucking great. Thank you. Your body looks great. <laughs> not to be sexual. No, no, not to be sexual. In a purely objective way. Yeah, pure, you know what? This tub is a little smaller than the last one. Why the fuck would you say that? No, no, no. I mean, look. <laughs> no, it, but this is a, I mean, the last tub that I had was in uh, the state of Texas. Yeah. And everything's bigger, everything's in, bigger in Texas, and also everything's much cheaper in Texas. Yeah. I do want to let you know that I have been in both your place and Ms. Kip's place. Uh -huh. It's very clear that you have more money. I'm flattered. Yes, I I'm just flattered. thought that I'd let you know. Ludwig, why don't you introduce yourself to everybody here, just in case they don't know who you are. Uh, hello, I'm Ludwig, yes. and I stream some times. Yes, great. That Amazing. crushes in business meetings. Yes, absolutely. absolutely. Are you on all your business meetings? No, fuck no. You're not on all your business meetings? Do you think I am? No. You, I got, you have an agent and a manager. I show up sometimes. Yeah, yeah. absolutely. What's the audio? Are we this guy? Uh, yeah, wait, wait. So the, the audio right here? Yeah. Is that where the mic's coming from? Hey, yeah. we also got a two-camera setup. Show them the two-camera setup. You got two-camera? Look at that one right there. Check oh, it out. Shit. This may be the best production I've ever done. Check that yeah, out right there. Too. It's not very flattering. Can we go back to the other one? <laughs> That's the cock okay. view. Yeah, it's the cock view, um, for sure. Um, Ludwig, uh, have you watched this show before? Yeah, I have. Okay, did you? Did you? Can I tell you something by yourself? Yeah. You're so funny. Why? Okay, tell me. Because the moment the camera rolls, the way you talk changes. Wait, okay, 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 what do you mean? Okay, okay, ready? This is all okay. soft camera, soft okay, camera. Okay. Hey, is it okay if I use your bathroom? I don't think it bothers. <laughs> It'd be great, sorry, sorry. Okay, okay. And then also, off camera, I was like, folks, it's not a sexual show. <laughs> it's not a sexual show. Don't comment on my body. Okay, but it's not a sexual show. Proof being, uh, that I elevate things for the camera. Yeah, so true. I'm not actually like I'm a very am I kind person? <laughs> am I a nice person? You are. Okay. But I didn't want to give it to you because it seems like you wanted me to give it to you. It's true. I, yeah, you are. I'm a kind person. You're sweet. You're sweet. Am I a nice guy? You're sultry. Sultry. Yeah. What What, what does that mean exactly? You Yeah. Uh, you, I'm kind of fishing for compliments. You beat your little shit. I beat. I beat, I beat my little shit. <laughs> yeah. If somebody told me you beat your little shit, it uh -huh. means like you're either. Like you're beating your little dick. Or you got a small wife. <laughs> <laughs> well, look, Ludwig, at yeah. every In the Tub show, yeah. we have alcoholic beverages. That's true. And one of my favorite beverages, and I think it's Tub... Okay. Oh, yeah. 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 Not sexually. No, 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 absolutely not. Tub adjacent beverage is champagne. Mm. So I bought some sure, of my... Can I check? Can I check here? Sure. You, this is your, one of your favorites? One of my favorites. Is it real? Yep. It's real. It's California Sparkling Wine. Yes. <laughs> one of my favorite brands. It's California Sparkling. You, you brought a Frenchman. Yeah. California Sparkling oh, Wine. Oh, believe me, we know a lot about your culture, Ludwig. We brought even uh, some snacks that you would appreciate. Some good, authentic French fries. Come on, bring them in. Oh, oh yeah. Even Look less at this, huh? No, but nothing says French like uh, some champagne and some French fries. What? Huh? Andy Cap. You think Cap is a French name? Mm hmm. Andy Cap. <laughs> <laughs> so, anyway, let's say uh, if you want to pop open a bottle here. Crack it open. open. Crack it open. Crack it open. Treat me. Yeah, absolutely. I'd love to. I've even got some glasses. Why is there only one glass, Rob? There's two. There's two. Oh, there's two. Could you grab that for me, Rob? I can't. I'm in the tub. Hold on. Just don't aim it. Oh, shit. 
This one's gonna be for you. <laughs> Do you want any more? <laughs> this is, tell me when, I'm, I'm gonna let, Right there, right there, right there, right there. Please. Would you mind passing me the other? Yes, glasses? of course. Yes. We, okay. got nothing but, we have champagne glasses here. Do you really? Yeah, like many. Yeah, Rob. What the fuck? Did you where, where? Did you not find anything? It's in our champagne cabinet. This is an upgrade for Miss Kip, who didn't even have glasses. Growing up, my mom mm. had a uh, a china cabinet. Mm -hmm. She got china as a wedding gift. Why did they call it a china cabinet? Uh, because chinas were a valuable noun to describe. Like nicer wares. Okay. Okay. Like fine china. Fine china. But where did they get the yeah. shine came from China? I wanna do you a favor right now. Okay. We're early in the show. Change your lock screen auto lock settings. Cause it's set to 20 seconds and you have to tap so it doesn't auto lock on you every 20 seconds. You realize that this is my third in the tub show. Yeah. Okay. You're gonna change my life. I used to work at Apple Support. That's cheers. Okay, cheers. Throughout. Did you really? Two and a half years. Two and a half years of I Apple thought you support. did your research. I know, I didn't do anything. They, my producers did their research. I didn't do anything. I've got lots of questions on it. You, you strap oh, in. Oh, that's fine. That's a, that's a fine, it's you, sweet. You realize you're gonna change my life right now, right? Auto lock. Okay. So yours is set to 30 seconds. It's the smallest amount. <laughs> We're just gonna throw it to never for this show. I'm never gonna get back to this and it's never gonna lie. Then maybe five minutes? Somebody's gonna steal my phone. Let's do five. Five minutes, okay, perfect. Five minutes is a good good amount. That's amazing. What jobs did you have before streaming? Uh, cheers. Cheers. Mm. Mm. Why do you make those noises when you drink? <laughs> I just, I like to show that I appreciate the, the drink. Okay, cheers. Cheers. Mm. Mm. I actually make those noises in real life. like. The camera here doesn't actually change how I would react. I, I actually believe that. Yeah, I, I go, mm, mm, mm. Do you know what a Minecraft villager is? No. You sound like one. <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> What's a, I don't know what a Minecraft villager is. Do they go, mm, mm, mm. Yeah, no, almost <laughs> exactly, yeah. Mm. They, they walk around, they go, mm, 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 mm. Yeah. Mm, mm, mm. Anyway, so uh, your mom, China. My mom, China, jobs. Your mom's from China. She's from France. Okay, got it. Got Born it. in Normandy. Okay. Normandy? Yep. Was she around during the invasion? She's 60. How long ago? <laughs> she, she wasn't when did, born when yet. When did the war end? Did, she, did her mother give birth to her on Normandy in commemoration of the invasion of D-Day? Yeah, they went to the beach and then they <laughs> they they bore her at the beach. It was a natural birth. Was she was she was she conceived? Folks, it's beautiful and natural. It was fantastic, <laughs> believe me. Uh, yeah, she was conceived during the war. Wow, okay. During when, the when did the war end? Uh, 1945. I knew you would know. Uh -huh. I knew you would know. I know a lot. I'm actually a pretty smart guy. I know. Bachelor's degree. You come off dumb. Really? But I know you're smart. Okay. What, um, I actually think that I come off dumb and I am dumb, but I am able to, I'm charismatic and I'm able to speak articulately, so I, I can sound smart if you don't know me. This is like, right? I think what you do maybe is I think maybe you're scared of coming off dumb. Okay. And so you pretend to be extra dumb. That way you can blame it on your attempt to be dumb. Okay. Rather than if you were genuine and you came off naturally dumb. So you're almost shielded mm. by this effort to appear dumb. Mm. Cause maybe if you didn't do it, you might just be regularly dumb. Right. I've so, done this. so I go to the extreme mm. to try to it's a it's a it's a defense mechanism. Because huh. I'm <laughs> so I'm actually dumb. So I just go to the extreme. We don't know. Okay we don't know yet. Because you have you know the song? This song right here? Yeah. No. Getting over it, Bennett Foddy. Is this your music that, did we, is this the stream music that you use? Yeah, I would use this. No, no, is this your stream music? No, this is made from a, for a very famous Foddy in video game. It created a genre of video games. The guy who made Quop, if you remember that game, is a guy running down a track, you can only use QWOP. Wow. He made a video game called Getting Over It. Oh and my this God. the soundtrack to it. That's incredible. It's a beautiful song. You are very intelligent. I know a lot. My parent, my dad was like very impressed by you. And what's interesting? Uh, because he's like, wow, that Ludwig, that's, he's a really smart kid. Oh, oh just off, name your price? Yeah. It's because I banked the croc price. Yeah. Do you shave your body hair to show off your body more? Yes. Do you shave your body hair? I don't grow any. You have armpit hair? Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah. It's nice. Do you have armpit hair? Yeah. This, so this is, <laughs> is that it? That's all my chest hairs, yeah. That's it. That's all Do I have. You, have you ever shaved your chest at all? No, I've shaved this once like four years ago. Your happy trail? Yeah. Happy trails are sexy, keep it. I, well, yeah, I stopped doing it. Okay, good. This is all I can grow, man. That's it. What, what about your butt? 
My butthole? No, not well, not your butthole specifically. My cheek has no hairs on it. Cheek, your well, everybody's butthole has a little bit of hair. Yeah, my hair, my hair is in the hole for sure. Yeah, hair is in the hole. Keep it in there. That yeah, keep it in there. Don't let it out. That's right. If you shave it, I heard it's, I did it once actually. Wait, you did? Why? Uh, I I feel like sometimes. Are you trying to bother? No. <laughs> sometimes when you shave, yeah, you get kind of carried away. Sure. You're just like, where could this razor go? Yeah. Yeah. Because like, mm -hmm. there's not a defined line of where you start and end. Mm -hmm. You could do the shaft. You yeah. could do the 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 gooch. The taint. The taint. The taint. That's the gooch. The gooch. Okay. Different. Is that the French word for gooch? Uh, no. They say um, gooch. Gooch. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, okay, I've got a question for you. Yeah, please. You, a lot of people don't know this, but before Ludwig was famous, mm -hmm. do you consider yourself famous? No. Depends where I am. Okay. If I'm in a Best Buy, mm -hmm. sure. Okay. Celebrity. Where's the least, how often do you get recognized when you go out? So that's what I mean by it depends. Mm -hmm. right? On a day to day, maybe every other day I'll get recognized. Okay. It's not like every day I walk out on the street. Okay. I think especially in LA, uh -huh. like I went to a restaurant and the booth next to me was Ben Savage, mm. the actor mm. in, uh, what's that show? Corey Matthews. Yeah. And he's more famous than me. But you got recognized in the No, restaurant? I didn't get recognized, but that's what I'm saying. It's yeah. like, no people just in, in LA. LA. Yeah. I ran into Jack Black. Did you say I No. What? He looked sweaty. Yeah, well, he's, he's probably doing something fucking incredible. He was walking, he had like a walking stick. I, he was, his head was down. Oh, so he didn't want to be talking. Yeah, to. he wasn't looking like he was in the mood. Yeah, oh my god, when was this? Maybe like three months ago, two months god. ago? I love Jack Black, but I get it. You have, you're a star. Chris Pine. Wow. I sat next to Matthew, um, oh gosh. McConaughey? No, not McConaughey. Matthew? No, no, actually, I don't know who it was now. I don't, I forgot. But I sat next to somebody famous at Soho House. Okay. Uh, and that was pretty incredible. There's famous folk? Yeah, there's a lot of famous folks. As I was going to say, Please. a lot of people don't know this, but before Ludwig was famous in certain places, yep. he came on my show. Which show? You came on Love or Host. So you... I didn't come on your show Love or Host. Okay, and you got eliminated. I think second. T tell me, tell me, oh, you were the second person out. Tell me what that experience was like, and have you ever, did that give you a chip on your shoulder? I want to know how you felt about me immediately after that happened. So I've always thought of you as like a producer of sorts. Okay. You can call yourself the wine scene of Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> and I initially knew you because you, to some degree, yeah. were a big part in early Cutie career. Sure. And I knew Cutie before, like when before we met. Sure. Like I knew well sure. her as a streamer. Sure, sure. Because sure. I'd seen sure. some of your shows. Was she the main guest at that point? She. This is when she was kind of like a rock star on your show. She okay. Was, I think it's just like when she just started like sure, kind of figuring out how to win <laughs> on Lover Host. Mm -hmm. Uh, and this is this back when your shows were ratchet. Mm. They would talk about your show like the swill of the earth. Yeah, it was like it was like the it was just. Just grungy and yeah. just dirty. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And so I, you know, I was watching, and then you had Mia Malkova on. Okay. As oh, as the main contestant. As the main contestant. I think Call Me Carson was on that show. Possible. I don't remember. And Schlads. Wait, was that on the Mia Malkova one? No, maybe it was a different actress. Was it Mia Malkova? Am I wrong? It may have been. Who was in other? Adriana Chechik? No. Um, maybe it was Mia. Chat. Would anyone know? Does anybody know? I think it was Mia Malkova. Okay, Mia Malkova. I think it was, and and I don't know. I I I, I Sasha Gray maybe. I think I no. I think it was Mia Malkova. I think I vaguely remember wanting to be on the show mm -hmm. because I thought it'd be funny, mm. as opposed to like maybe a regular streamer, mm -hmm. someone who's an adult actress has like yeah. I think lower stakes being on this show mm -hmm. than if it were like you know. Like a Minecraft YouTuber, where mm -hmm. it's like, mm -hmm. this feels a little weird, feels a little more intimate. Or yeah, absolutely. And I thought I'd go on, uh -huh. and I would be super funny, uh -huh. and uh -huh. I would walk away. Because you're a funny guy. I thought I would charm people. Sure. That was my Because you're French. I was French. Ludwig. Yeah. Didn't even know what that meant at the time. Didn't know Ludwig was a French name. Yeah, it's not. Yeah. Still. I thought that was a made-up It's a German name. name. Is it really? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I thought, until this moment... I went from thinking Ludwig was a name you chose as your username uh -huh. to, oh, it was a birth given French name. Yeah. To now it's a German name? Mm -hmm. I had no fucking idea. It's Ludwig. 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 Yeah. Ludwig van Beethoven. Yeah. Oh, fuck. 
Yeah. Beethoven. He's not French. Son of a bitch. No, he's not. Yeah. I actually thought he was French up until this fucking point. <laughs> That's bad. Yeah. I mean, French, all white people look like. Ooh. Oh, yeah. So, That's going to strike a chord with those oppressed white people. <laughs> Where are I right? I'm already doing the liberal humiliation ritual. <laughs> <laughs> For a nice acting gig. Shay. Cheers, Arby. <laughs> <laughs> so, I made a joke, didn't land, and then I got, I was so nervous I took a shot. Mm. Cause I was like, maybe this will make me feel better. Sure. Show starts, first person eliminated, it's e -Rob. Yeah, typical. <laughs> <laughs> and I remember a weight being- By the way guys, this was probably like six years ago. Oh yeah. So, still out taking L's six years ago, over half a de decade. I remember a weight okay. being lifted off my shoulder. Yep, yep. Because you're not the first one. And then I but you were in the bottom three, probably. I was. Knowing you, <clears> because <throat> I probably put the some people in the bottom three. And I made a joke uh -huh. that it was something to the effect is like a self-deprecating joke. Mm -hmm. And she like it was like, if you what's your favorite sex position? Uh huh. Uh -huh. What's your favorite? What position? You had a night with Mia, or something yeah, like that. Yeah, yeah. Uh, and I was like, I was like, one where she could feel it. <laughs> I mean, that's a good joke. I thought it was like a funny, self-deprecating <laughs> joke. And then the the room was silent. <laughs> there wasn't even a chuckle, bro. God, I bet I could find that. I bet somebody could find that moment. And and nobody laughed, and I got eliminated right after, and then I felt fucking dejected. But that's a good joke. It was a joke that was ahead of its time. I think what it was is the mm. show is serious. In the sense that the people who compete yeah. are actually trying to out machismo each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. As opposed to out entertain each other. Sure. Depends on the show, but this that one, in, this one in particular. Yeah. Okay, so how did you feel about me afterwards? I mean, same old, same old. Like I thought, like honestly, it was, it was like you know, you would throw together whatever was the most controversial, mm -hmm. clicky. That's right, crazy folks. Crazy show. Believe me. And and it was more so like you were just trying to put everybody in a room together that might cross some fire, mm -hmm. and then just watch the sparks. Fuck yeah. And, and that was it. Honestly, in a different lifetime, could have been the guy running Hunger Games. Really? <laughs> yeah, could you imagine? Yeah. And, and then the show would start, they would be like, do I look good? All right, we got eight-year-old Primrose. <laughs> She's just been murdered. She's been murdered by a flock of birds. <laughs> and the camera cuts, you're like, where's my makeup cut? The, 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 do you look good is so, because, okay. Can I, can I be vulnerable now? Please. Before every show, Rob can attest to this, we test the lighting. I mean, <laughs> you test a little more than that. What do you mean? You were doing crunches. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's downstairs. Hold on. Uh, 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 yeah, but hold on, but hold on, hold on. That's a normal activity for somebody who's gonna get on camera with their shirt off. Right? I don't know. If you're gonna get on camera with your shirt off, you're gonna do push-ups, you're gonna do crunches because this is me, baby. This is what I got. I mean, you look good. You've been working out a lot. This is what I, this is what I got for you. Here, can we give him a little? This is what I got. Can we give him a little? It's good for our. It's good for our views. What? Just a little flex, dude. Why is? Do you have an implant? No, that's my. That's that's real. <laughs> Don't walk. That's real. That's real. Yeah. Well, I'm not there, bro. I'm not there. You got big tries though. Oh yeah, you got I love good tries. tries. I love. You got you got good tries. That's a fun thing. To work. Absolutely. Yeah, Twitch himbos. You know who Twitch himbos are? Uh, no. They're a, uh, a porn account on Twitter that oh. posts uh, very sexy photos of all of us. Do you love them? I do. Every, I'm the only streamer that knows about all these niche accounts. You, you keep in touch too much. Oh. <laughs> you think so? Probably unnecessarily, I should say. I, I mean, I've stopped. The only person I interact with is Antibiker. I hate that fucking... I, I know. So tell me, Rotten? Get, yes. Devious? Yes. Yes. Tell me more. Cretan. Uh. Tell me why. Because what did they do? To you? I've squarely pinned the blame on them for leaking my balls. Now hold on, my In balls are leaked. Yeah, your balls are your balls are out there. My balls are out there. Look at my balls. Your balls are out there. Dan Clancy might have seen them. Which ball? He, how does that make you feel? Not great. Do you think that's why you didn't get another Twitch contract? Probably. I don't get to see his. Do you think that would be? Would you sign with Twitch? Be <laughs> sure. <laughs> if Dan showed you his balls, put them on the table. If you put him he on said, the table, he, he said, he said, Lyndon B. Johnson style? Yes! Yeah. You said, why should I try to sign with Twitch? He fucking pulls his cock and balls that's out right. and says, that's why. Right. That would be, that'd be I, a move. I think, I'll be honest, if that happened, I think I'd sign with Twitch. <laughs> I think, I'd, I'd sign a contract yeah. for whatever they wanted to pay me. And I think that's why you love anti bike <laughs> <laughs> Right there.
Right there, the proof's in the pudding. That's insane. Can I give an anecdote but, about well, how you're such a misogynist real quick? <laughs> Austin is such a misogynist. The reason I'm on the show is not because I was initially invited. Okay. I'm a Phil. Yeah. And the reason I'm a Phil is because Cutie has you, Cutie. You were going to get invited for the record. We were going to have a Ludwig. Eventually, I'm sure. Yes, absolutely. But reach Cutie out. was initially going to be the guest. Okay. And she she had her period. Okay. And she said, oh, I can't do it. I'm on my period. Okay. And then you asked a couple other women. I did. And then they also said... They were on their period. And then you went to Cutie. And yeah. I'm, I'm out of you here. Okay. And you went... What's the big deal? No, I did like, not. That is a lie. <laughs> What's going on? That is a period. That is a lie. Can we just sit in the tub? No, 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 no. That is a lie. I will read you the text messages. Hold on. I will read you the text messages. This is what I said to Cutie. I said, I understand the situation is out of your control. Uh -huh. <laughs> I said, okay, no worries. He was like, just get in, like, to yeah. tape it shut. Yeah, I did not. Okay. You kept saying, we'll tape it shut. I didn't put any of that in there, okay? He said, I'm I so sorry. Very, I'm so sorry I, what Eve did to you. I was very, <laughs> I was very understanding. Yeah, you were. No, okay. no, you were very sweet about it. I was it. very sweet but about I, it. Maybe misunderstanding. I was, no, no, no. I was very understanding, and I said, I immediately, I didn't push the issue, okay? A lot of you are gonna think that I did. Ludwig is spreading a rumor, which we will do later. By the Propaganda. way, propaganda. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna start a rumor. Oh, I love that. We're gonna start a rumor because I think it's fun to start rumors, right? Yep. Yeah. But before we do that, Lud, I have an entire show planned, mostly for Cutie Cinderella, though. Great. Right? And I've got a game that we were gonna play with Cutie, but we've decided it's so good we have to play it with you. Okay. Okay. This is. This is a genius game, and I'm gonna say I came up with it. Okay. Right, Rob? Yep, all by yourself. Thank you. Wow. Thank you, Rob. Completely original. This this game is called Taylor Swift or Joseph oh, Smith. Fucking sh This is the worst game. No. You're making no, 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 me no. play. <laughs> Who said it? Dude. Taylor Swift or Joseph Smith? Taylor okay. Swift, the famous pop artist, so Joseph Smith, the, the creator of the Book of Mormon. Yes. So this was, you need to know, Fuck. you need to be a good boyfriend, okay? Why? No, a good the boyfriend. Book of Mormons being you, no, it, this isn't quotes from the book. These are quotes from the individual. So these aren't necessarily from her songs or from the Book of Mormon. Okay. All right. They just said it. Right. They just said it. Now, for the record, I want to be clear here. If Ludwig gets them all correct, I will give him a kiss on the cheek. Whoa. Yeah, that's right. If you get them incorrect, you know you get no kisses. Okay? Wow. No kisses on the cheek. Right. All right. Uh, I don't know. First one. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. A man I saved no faster than he gains knowledge. That's gotta be Joseph Smith. That's correct. Yeah. That's Joseph Smith. Okay. Nice job. Here we go. You don't know me. You never knew my heart. Taylor Swift. <laughs> it's gotta be. There's no way Joseph Smith starts a sentence, you don't know me. Like, what is he? he it sounds a little catty for him. He started Mormonism. It was Joseph Smith. No, you're lying. I'm not lying. Joseph Finish Smith. Finish the sentence. No man knows my history. Joseph Smith. Wait, wait, say the whole thing. You don't know me. You never knew my heart. No man knows my history. That is Taylor Swift. That's just Joseph You're Smith. lying. No, I swear to God. You're lying. I swear to God. Promise. Promise. Swear my mom. You're lying. Oh, my mom will die. Drop dead. Joseph Smith said you don't know me? Yep. Is he gay? I don't know. Maybe he was. Okay. Moving on to the next question. Moving on. I think the perfection of love is that it's not perfect. Taylor Swift or Joseph Smith? Yeah, I have a theory. Okay. I think all of these quotes are Joseph Smith. Really? Yes. Okay. So who is this? Joseph Smith. T Taylor Swift. Kill me! <laughs> you have gotten you have gotten <laughs> one right. One correct. One for three. Can you keep track, Rob? Yes. Okay. Here, here we go. Next one. I don't blame anyone for not believing my history. If I had not experienced what I have, I would not have believed it myself. That's gotta be Joseph Smith. It's Joseph Smith. There you go. Nice job. Okay, here we go. Because he's, he's talking about how the God came to If him. you get one more correct, I'll still give you a kiss on the cheek. I never did harm any man since I was born in the world. My voice is always for peace. Joseph Smith. That's correct. Yeah, nice job. Nice job. Okay. It is our duty to concentrate all of our influence to make popular that which is sound and good and unpopular that is which is... Uh, <laughs> Joseph Smith. That's correct. Yeah, you, you, you can't even say the sentence, it's so old. Okay, all right. It, who said this one? 
we don't need to share the same opinions as others, but we need to be respectful. Taylor Swift. Yes, that's You correct. don't gotta be respectful, you, you would not say that. Here we go. Next one, who said it? Joseph Smith or Taylor Swift? Words can break someone into a million pieces. <laughs> <laughs> but they can also put them back together. Yeah, Taylor Swift. How do you know that? Oh, come on. Is that a song? No, but like Joseph Smith, the creator of the Book of Mormon, would be like, words can break us, but they'll never tear us apart. The God is with us. Like, you wouldn't say it. It sounds like a little too, you know. It maybe sounds like a Mormon mom, right? Maybe, like... Yeah, yeah, I can believe it's like a Mormon mom, but what's a Mormon mom listening to? That's true. Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift, that's true. Here we go. Taylor Swift or Joseph Smith, who said it? I'm very aware and very conscious of the path I chose in life and very aware of the path I didn't choose. Mmm, tougher. I want to say Joseph. Taylor! Bob. Taylor Swift! Yeah. These are fucking good. That one was a These little These are tough. fucking good. That that Taylor said that. Taylor Swift said that. I could believe it was Taylor. It sounded... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, all right. Last one. All right. If you get it, I'll chug the rest of that. <laughs> <laughs> Check it out, Chad. How about you drink that bottle of Listerine? <laughs> are you saving my present? <laughs> Where's the bottle? Let's show him the bottle. Go grab the bottle of Listerine. If you get this correct, I got to chug this bottle of Listerine. I think that'll kill you. I'm not gonna swallow it. Oh, that's what I wanted you to do. Oh, you want me to <laughs> All right, so I don't have to chug it? You do. Okay, but hold on. Uh, can you give me a cup to spit into? Spit it in the tub. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I spend a lot of time balancing between faith and disbelief. Red herring, Taylor Swift. Oh. <laughs> you would think it's Joseph Smith because the word faith, it's a red herring. Spit it back in the bottle, I got you. Why, why are you doing it weird? <laughs> why do you look so fucking weird? What are you doing? Why is it so slow? This can't be the most effective way. Jesus Christ. You probably want to, can you put this back on the counter? You can swallow the rest of that. It won't kill you. Drink this. That's gonna taste so bad. <laughs> It was Taylor Swift. That actually tasted pretty good. To my health? Yes, please. Absolutely. You know what they say in Japan? Uh, arigatou gozaimasu. Ah! Arigatou gozaimasu. Ah, uh, that's good. Okay, I had, an, I had a game called What the Duck. <laughs> okay. Dude, you're just ripping off another gay man from fucking 2011. Wait, what are you talking about? What the buck? Wait, what is that? Wait, how do you know more? What, what, what are you talking about? One of the first pioneers of gay content creation. Wait, who, uh, Fred? What the buck? What? I don't even know what this is. What is what the buck? What do you mean, Michael Buckley? I don't know his first and last name. Wait, wait, hold on, wait, wait. He, somebody, who is, who's Michael Buckley? Somebody says I'm a fake gay. He's like a guy who used to deliver, I, I, would, I would. Oh my God, people are calling me a fake gay, no way. I, I categorize it as like, uh, oh no. like commentary news. He was a gay man. His name is Michael Buckley, mm -hmm. and his show is called What the Buck. I have never seen that. That's so insane. That's incredible. You know what's also incredible? What? The next game. Bring it out. Ludwig, you have been known for tier listing. Sure. For the first time ever, folks, we're going to ask Ludwig to tier list his tier lists. We have gotten all of the tier lists that you have ever done in the history of your career. Wow. Really? And we're asking you That's so many. to tier list your tier list. Okay. I can do that. Okay? And we've got them right here. Chap, if you're not familiar with the tier list, alright? You don't have to explain it to them. Okay. Somebody said this is so shit. This is a this is a bad idea. No, don't. It's, you got one guy. This is a bad idea? Why are you getting louder? This is a great idea. It's getting louder, right? It's a great yeah. fucking idea. You don't have to get louder. I think it's a great fucking Hold idea. Hold my hand. Hold my hand. Here we go. So this is a tier list of my tier list. Bald person tier list. Pause. Okay. The tier list is gonna go, this was amazing, I would do it a second time. Sure. A, that it was worthwhile. Okay. It's a good informative tier list. Okay. 
B. Okay. Maybe a good tier list. I might have been out of my depth. Okay. I, my tier list might have not have been accurate. Okay. C. Why did I rank this? Okay. Still maybe a little charm to it. Okay. F. I should have never done this. Okay. Bald person tier list. Ah. Uh, I would throw a bald person tier list at B. B I don't feel like me with my set of hair, I should be speaking on this. Mm. It'd be like if I made, you know, a gay person tier list. Okay, perfect. B. Shouldn't do it again. Yeah. Ludwig ranks every beer. Oh, S tier. S tier. That's a great tier list to do. I've done it many times. Okay. I think it's worthwhile. Okay, got it. I tried every cereal and ranked them. I'd go A tier. Okay, A tier. It, it. It's a good one time thing, but really the biases come through on this one. Okay, sure. Every fast food burger slimes oh. in the thumbnail. Every fast food burger is S tier. S tier, done. I'm an American, I love burger. Put it up there for me. Okay. Uh, you did a tier list with Connor about, I forced a British man to try every fast food. Every fast food place is a bit too big of scope. I would put it A tier. I think it has charm because I made a British man do it. Okay, good. I ranked every YouTuber. Bad idea. That says bad idea. Can I see that one? There's no way you could do it again. So this is my most recent attempt at this. I did it for real once. Mm -hmm. This one isn't that bad because what I actually did is I called people and then I ranked them how quickly they responded. Okay. But the idea of ranking every YouTuber I've done before I don't know if that's in here. Mm. This I one, think, okay. I'll throw this one B tier. Okay, B tier. Because not again. actually a YouTuber tier list. Halloween candy, C tier. C tier. I I think actually ultimately I don't like sweets. You lost a lot of weight since that one. Did you edit your face to be bigger? That was a couple months ago. I weighed five pounds less. Holy shit! Wait, what? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you weighed less? In yeah, this I weighed one? less there. Somebody, your thumbnail editor did you dirty? I edited it. You made it bigger? I don't. But I had facial hair. Did you edit the facial hair in? No. I just had facial hair then. It didn't look great. I look kind of like a- You look good. I thought I was trying to compliment you now. I feel like I look like a retired soccer player. I think you look great. Thanks. You've always been one of the most attractive people I know. That's a lie. Americans try everything from Japanese McDonald's. I would throw that C tier. I think ultimately Japanese McDonald's is so similar to American McDonald's that there's not that much value. Okay. I ranked every mobile game. I'm gonna go F tier. That's a lie. Every mobile game. I don't think any. I don't think people care about mobile games, buddy. This is wrong because it's nostalgia. Okay. I would throw this one A tier. Wow. Okay. So I made a Twitch streamer tier list. That one is bad. Okay. Because I actually did it. That got me into some heat. Okay. I'm gonna throw that one F tier. F tier. Holy that shit. That was, it was a mistake. Yeah, it was a mistake because I wasn't even on the fucking list. Uh, well, I, yeah. That was when I was scared of being overtly homophobic. Oh, okay, <laughs> really? Now no, you're not afraid of that. I think, uh, you met, actually, Jinxie and some other streamers did it recently. Okay. And they just, they, they went the coward's route, which is similar to what I did. They just put everybody S. Okay. Got They're it. like S or I don't watch them as the backup. Okay, got it. Am I smarter than these streamers? Was I on this one? I don't remember this tier list. Am I smarter than these streamers? Mm -hmm. Am I smarter? Mm -hmm. I, I genuinely don't remember. It, it should be an F then. Okay, F. YouTubers I can beat in a fight. Good one. Mm -hmm. S tier? I think, yeah, S tier. S tier. Okay, now, uh, chat, we started to run out of printer ink. I'm noticing. <laughs> um, so these are going to become exponentially, increasingly difficult to read as we go on. Ranking the best YouTuber songs. It's a fun idea. I think a lot of them suck. Mm -hmm. uh, and it's maybe a little mean-spirited. I'll throw it B tier. B tier. Uh, streamers I can beat in a fight. You did that twice? Yeah, I farm shit again. Okay, let's just throw that one out. Because you already did that. Yeah, I did. Okay. I rank YouTubers, and I don't even know what this is. Can you read it? I can't read it. So I ranked YouTubers. This is a genuine YouTube tier list, also F tier. Okay, F tier. I rank streamers I've met in real life. Cuties in every thumbnail, by the way, that Twitch is involved in. I rank streamers. Are you using I've your met girlfriend for cloud? I think I ranked people I have kissed. Was I in there? I don't know if I'd kissed you. At you this and point. I kissed. It's true. Chat, do you know Gladwing and I had kissed? I'm gonna throw this F tier. Okay, F tier. Which streamer has the best dick? <laughs> what is it? I'm kidding, you didn't do that to your list. You question it though. Which streamer has the best laugh? Yeah. Ah, it's also kind of mid, I'll throw that. 
It should be F tier. I'm gonna stack it here. Wow, F tier. Look at this, chat. Give us a round of applause. This was a great segment. I didn't come up with this one, but everybody loved it. Right? Isn't that right, chat? You loved it? Huh? What do you think about that? Look, look, you didn't expect this to be put together, did you? Awesome with you in charge? Of course I did. Of course you did. You knew that was gonna happen. He doesn't miss. I don't miss. That's what they say about him. That's what they say about me. Now, Ludwig, I've got another thing to do. Okay. It's very exciting. Sure. This is called... What the Duck. Oh. This segment, uh -huh. Ludwig, there's a bunch of ducks in the tub. There are. Okay? A bunch of ducks. All right? And on a, each one of these ducks is a number. Yep. When we pull the duck, there's something on this card that is associated with the number. Okay. All right. I'm going to pull this ducky right here. Number five. Number five. Uh, okay. We had a thing called, you used to sell babes. <laughs> what is this? A zig? Yeah. A six milligram? No, no, no. You don't got to take it. Why not? You, you can if you want, but that's not what the that's not what the game was. Okay. We it was supposed to be sell me this vape, but we don't have a vape. I'm doing it. You want to do pussy? I can't. I do not want to I swear. Put it, for, put it in for thirty seconds. I swear to God. Put it in for thirty. Ludwig, seconds. the show would be over, buddy. Thirty seconds. Ludwig, I swear to God. I'm not trying to sell it to you. I'm trying to give it to you. No. Wait. This is literally <laughs> the segment. Listen to me. No, no, no. I have one in. No, no, Ludwig. I'll put two in. Ludwig. I put two in. You put one in. Ludwig. Thirty when, seconds. When I tell you. Do you, do you know your girlfriend? Yes. Imagine if you gave one to Cutie. I would say 30 seconds, babe. No, <laughs> you wouldn't. I'd say, babe, there's, do you trust me? Th there's no, that's the first thing to say. Do you trust me? There's, I could never. Just put it in your mouth, spit it out right away. It won't do a thing. I can't do it. won't it. do a thing, I promise. I refuse. You, then do me a favor. Okay, what's that? I'll give you a kiss instead. Close your eyes. No. <laughs> I'm not going to put it in your mouth against your will. That'd be literally illegal. <laughs> Open your mouth. <laughs> this, I'm not going to do it. This is a trust exercise. No, what? <laughs> this is a trust exercise. It's crazy. Close your mouth. Close your mouth for real. Oh, excuse me. Now close your eyes. Put your hand over your eyes. <laughs> Come on. I can't do it. Just trust me. I, 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 I can't look, do look it. Look at me this. I won't put a zin in your mouth without you wanting to do it. Now close if your you eyes. Do, you got to give me 10 grand. Promise. Close your eyes. Open your mouth. Move your hand. I can't do it. You can't even trust me. I can't. You're coming closer. <laughs> I know, because I'm- With this in. I'm wondering if you're gonna close your mouth because you hear me coming closer. Yes, I'm gonna close my mouth. How would you that? sell that to me? Uh, I couldn't. You couldn't, why not? Because you're not willing. I don't sell vapes to people who don't want vapes. Okay. I sell vapes to people who want to expand a part of their mind they haven't accessed before. You know how you're still chasing capital? Yeah. Keep chasing. Okay. Right now, as this zin is hitting my brain, okay. I'm unlocking the next 50%. All right, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take a duck this time. All right, you take a duck. Can I ask you then? Sure. Number two. Number two. Austin, what's been grinding your gears lately? Straight people. <laughs> what does that mean? Straight people at clubs. How quickly can you tell if someone's straight or gay? By the way. They're just being. Do you think it'd be problematic if I said all of this, but said, what's been bothering you? Gay people. Yes. And you said, can you tell straight people and gay people? I'd be like, yeah, they're just gay. Yeah. It would be problematic because gay people are perfect. Do you think that? Yeah, I do. What is your most annoying gay stereotype that you find to be true that bothers you? Uh, is there like something about the gay community or maybe a general- That annoys me that's true? Yes. Fuck, that's a really good question. Mm that annoys me that's true. Well, if it annoyed me, I would think I would be at least in denial that it's true, so there's no way I'd admit it. Sure. Chat, um, our support of messy white women. What does that mean? I think, I think, I think, I think a lot of gays like a, lot, a messy white woman. Or just a messy woman in general. You're, you know what, not, not just women, a messy person. I'm, I'm being sexist and misogynist yet again. I don't want to alienate women. I don't because, think, I don't think you- Because I truly believe women are better than men. Really? I really do. You think outright across the board. 100%. Women are better than men. In what way? Emotionally, mature. I think they're better than men mm -hmm. in the sense that they cause less violence. True. And harm across the world. I would agree. Most murder, genocide, mm -hmm. car accidents yes. are done by men. It's true. But I think we could learn from women. I blame testosterone. I think it's problematic. I think so. Well, I think, I think we need to eliminate it. The existence of it. Yeah. I think we need to do it. Do this again for me? Wait, don't you like that? Estrogen could do it. <laughs>
Uh, pull a duck. I have number three. Okay. Uh, tortilla slap ch- What you meant? Tortilla slap challenge. Do I get to do it on you? We do it on each other. Yeah. Okay. How does this work? We slap each other with tortillas, we fill our mouths with water, and we spit pee. it out. Who gives a shit? You have to hold it in. Okay. You're a constant pressure. Alright, that's true. That's right. Alright, we need uh, to fill our cups with water. Uh, do we have water? Yeah, just fill a cup with tap. Oh, I love tortillas so much. Oh, shit! Bro, we have oh. water right here! Oh. We have water oh. right here! Oh, God! Just drink that, just drink that. Holy shit, that was fucking cold. Oh, my God. Oh, God. God, that was fucking cold as shit. I felt it a bit. Yeah. Just pour it back on your mouth. Oh, that's a great, I don't know why I did that. Okay. Okay, so how does this work exactly? Okay. Alright. Okay. okay. Fill your mouth all the way, that's your tortilla. Okay. Can you use that cup, fill your mouth okay. all the way. I lose. <laughs> I can't do it. It's too much. Mm -mm. I can't do it. Mm -mm. I can't do it. Mm -mm. I can't do it. Mm -mm. It hurts so bad. Mm -mm. I can't do it. Mm -mm. Why are you winding up like that? Mm -mm. I, why are you winding up like that? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh. Mm -mm. Lovely, I can't. Mm -mm. I can't get hit like that. Mm -mm. I don't like it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You're right in the man. <laughs> <laughs> I was so terrified. Have you never been punched in the face? No. I had a friend, Anders, in college. We used yeah. to punch each other in the face at parties as hard okay. as we could. Okay. Because we'd never been punched in the face. Yeah. And we never wanted to get in a fight and okay. not know what it felt like. Okay. And she got punched in the face. Yeah, by Anders. By Anders. She only time I've been punched. Is that... Did, did you like it? No, I would wake up with bruises. Wait, you did this over... You would wake up when he beat the shit out of you in your sleep? Well, you'd punch each other, and we'd punch each other harder and harder and harder, because you can't do... Like, it's not on the first punch that you're brave enough. Like, you just keep going? Yeah. In we, the face. We do, like, five rounds. He played Ultimate Frisbee. Oh, uh, was it his party? Yeah. Call back if you've been here since the beginning. Show the duck. Number six. Awesome. Yeah. I need you... Tell me. ...to tweet out... No, wait, that's not on there. It I, is. No, it's not. Start a book. <laughs> no, it's not about tweeting. Start a believable rumor. No, 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 this is not a tweet. What is it? It's a tweet. It's just you and I are to start a believable rumor about somebody. Let's do it about Hassan. That's too easy. Okay. Who are we doing it about? You could say that Jit does anything if people believe it. True. True. We need, maybe we need somebody nice, like super sweet, like Seku now. <laughs> Somebody said Will. I think, what's a believable rumor? About Will? Will jerks off during watch parties. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, like watch parties? He beats his shit during watch parties. Yeah. Like, like watch- Have you ever noticed during watch parties, he never shows his waist? <laughs> Do you, don't you think it's weird? I think it's strange. It's because he's beating his shit. That's so he true. He beats his shit during the watch party. That's so true. That's why Twitch removed them. Is because Will kept beating They his knew, man. but it didn't break guidelines because it was below the belt. Do you know why they just made the the ban of Twitch recently, the, the, the change? They banned on all, all sexuality. Yeah, it's because Hassan kept showing his asshole. <laughs> That's a believable rumor. I, I think so. Is that Hassan Piker would show his asshole? Yeah. <laughs> what did it look like? I'm gonna- somebody sent out a tweet. Haas Twit, let's spread that rumor. <laughs> that Hassan is the reason a leftist, radical leftist, Hassan Piker. Radical leftist. Radical leftist. Radical leftist. Looney leftist. Hassan Piker 
He couldn't resist showing his he southern showed, border. He shows his little pecker. Believe me, he showed his little balls and his little penis. He's got tiny balls. Believe me, it was really not fantastic. Was concerning. Believe me, he kept showing it. He kept showing his southern border. Uh, Believe me. What's more believable, my rumor or your rumor? Chat, oh. Chad, who do you think? Is it more believable that Will Neff jerks off during watch parties or the reason why Twitch banned sexuality, sexuality is because they, they banned sexuality. Banned sexuality. You, cannot you cannot be sexual. You cannot be sexual at all. At all. The loser gets slapped by a tortilla. Can I not talk about sexuality stuff anymore? No, course? you can. You, you just, just can't show butthole. I think they're trying to do a catch-all ban for the provocateur war. I think a provocateur, okay. provocative war. But what I love is that the provocateurs are going to find a way around it. Oh, of course. Yeah, they always do. I'm going to pull a duck. It's my turn for Oh, pull a duck. Pull a duck. Pull a duck. Uh, I will pull duck number eight. Eight? Eight. Sprite challenge. What is this? Oh, God. I didn't come up with this one. I don't think I'm realizing you came up with any of this. No, I came up with the t Taylor Swift or Joseph City. Let me, yeah, well, his idea. Okay. Okay. We gotta drink this Sprite. First person to burp loses. It has to suck the other one off. All right, ready? 63 grams of sugar? Oh, fuck. Is that how many? Are you fucking 64 grams of carbs? <laughs> Are you serious? I'm gonna spit it out. It is 126% of your sugar intake. <sighs> well, if you spit it out, you can't, you're not gonna burp. That's true. Fuck. Could you have gotten Sprite Zero or something? <laughs> <laughs> like, why do we get 64 grams of carbs? But you wanna do it with a beer? How many carbs are in the beer? Less? Yeah, there's gotta be less. It's one of the great joys of a Michelob Ultra. It only has, get this, 2.6 carbs. Oh my god, done. Done. And we get drunk? Do you have a bottle cap opener? It's a spin-off. All domestic beers are spin-offs. So, uh, Michelob Ultra, a Bud Light, know this. All domestics are spin-offs. Okay, here we go. International beers would be, uh, normal. Sorry. Cheers to our health. Drink! <laughs> 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 you lost! <laughs> that was the challenge! I know, I just wanted- I fucked you so I deserve to lose. You did. Four. I gotta take a shot out of your chest hole. <laughs> Actually? <laughs> I haven't done this one in a while. Wait, have you people have done this for you? Baby. Okay. <laughs> Wake up. Okay. <laughs> All right, people are very excited about this. I don't know how to, wait, hold on. I, so I have to position myself, you gotta move. Oh, fuck my phone. Shit. <laughs> God, damn it! Is that good? A little more. That's good. Okay. Never done this before. <laughs> uh, oh, that is fucking awful. Sweetheart, you didn't finish. <laughs> Sweetheart, you lost some food on the plate. <laughs> it's good, it's good, it's done. You don't challenge me. I will lick the shit out of your chest, okay? I'm washing out. Okay. <laughs> Number one, I want you to rank these podcasts from Kill Fuck Mary. Kill Fuck Mary? Is yep. that what it says? Okay. I'm making it up. Okay. Fear and. Okay. Wine about it. Okay. The Yard. Kill Wine about it. What, you rat bitch, you misogynist, fuck. I would never be able to have a fulfilling life with a woman. That's <laughs> and it's not because I'm misogynistic, it's just because I'm a homosexual. Okay, keep going. Can we cut the music? Cut, cut the music. Name a woman. Michelle, Obama. we're gonna go back and forth. Okay. First to be out to the misogynist. Okay. It cannot be a streamer. Okay. It cannot be a uh, fictional character. Okay. It can be any woman or their identity, like Ice Spice. How long do I have? As opposed to Isis. Sure, sure, sure. <laughs> <laughs> That's her name. Her name is Isis? Yeah. Oh, I knew that. How long do you have? We get like a few seconds. Okay. If there's too much of a pause, we'll feel it in the air. Sure, sure. Ready? I'm ready. Who would you say? Uh, Three. Michelle, Michelle Obama. AOC. Three. Two. <laughs> Whitney Houston. Jennifer Hudson. Mariah Carey. Jennifer Hughes. Lady Gaga. Jennifer Love Hewitt. Hillary Clinton. Kim Kardashian. Allison Cooper. Pretty sure Allison Cooper's a man. I, are you talking about Alice Cooper, the musician? No, no. <laughs> Who's Allison Cooper? Pause, check. Allison Cooper. Who's Allison Cooper? Tell him. Tell me who Allison Cooper is. Allison Cooper. No, no, no. They need to tell me. No, no, no. no. Who's Allison Cooper? Allison Cooper? We did that. Who's Allison Cooper? Hold on. That was not a part of the deal. Ludwig. No, you didn't say I had to know who they were. <laughs> no, I, I'm going to side with Lud here. Who is Allison Cooper? They're not famous enough. If you can tell me. Tell what me they're known for. Just say the field. Just say the it field. counts. The, the broad field. The field, yeah. Entertainment. 
No. What is it? Be more specific about no! the statement. No! I was right! <laughs> you guys keep moving the well, goalposts. That she's found, a girl boss. I found one actor named Allison Cooper. I told you they she's were an actress. One movie in 2014. I told you. And they were they were casted as high school student. That's right. <laughs> Can you name the movie? Yes, what? it was a movie about high school. <laughs> yeah, but what, what? In 2014? In yeah. 2014, what the fuck? It was, was it was a movie. It was it was set in a California-based high school, right? <laughs> Do I even know the movie? I I. What's it? What's it? It's movie? called In Paradise. I knew it. I knew it. Okay, <laughs> let's keep going because that's not fair. You didn't. You need to set the ground rules. We have to know who they are. Yes. Okay. You have to know who the woman is. Okay. Got it. Got it. Okay. Keep going. Go ahead. Uh, you start. No, I, I went. Margaret Thatcher. Uh, Kourtney Kardashian. <laughs> it can't be a streamer. You Three, said? two, Britney Spears. One, Chris Jenner. Beyonce. Caitlyn Jenner. How long do I have? Three, two. One. Oh my god, it's so much harder than you would think. Eliminated. It's so much harder than you would think. I don't think I was struggling. Let's do the version, but with a man. What does that mean? Like, same thing, but with men. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just curious. He's not talking to the no 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 no, 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 but hold on, but hold on. Chat, when there's pressure, I don't even think I could do it with men. Okay, okay. sure. Um, <laughs> Alice Cooper. Barack Obama. Uh, Donald Trump. Elton John. George Washington. George Clooney. Thomas Jefferson. Uh, Kirk Cousins. James Madison. Uh, Daniel Hunter. Tom Brady. Uh, Peyton Manning. Julian Edelman. Uh, Eli Manning. You know how it's easy? It's just rolling off the tongue. Here, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> it's so easy for you. You could go through the whole Vikings roster. You got 50 players to go. You know how easy that is for you? Let's, start, let's do the women one again. I think this person. All right. Okay, women from the top. Women from the top. And you have to know who they are. Yep. They cannot be a fictional character. Nope. They can be dead or alive. Can we run it back? Can we run it back for we All names are free. Okay. Sure. Kick us off. Lady Gaga. AOC. Beyonce. Uh, Michelle Obama. Britney Spears. Uh, uh, Selena Gomez. Hillary Clinton. Uh, let's go Kamala Harris. Oh, Kamala Harris. That was my next one. That's cheating. Three, <laughs> two, one. AOC. That being said, <laughs> no one has it. Yes, yes. yes. <laughs> no <one> has <laughs> you realized, hold on, fine. Let's name gay people. Let's do gay people. Let's do gay people. Let's do gay people. Do gay people. All right, sure. Gay people. Ready? Elton John. Austin Shaw. Are you said they couldn't be streamers? Well, for the gay people. Anderson Cooper. Michael Buckley. Um, <laughs> RuPaul. 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 Um... Uh, do bisexuals count? Yes. Queer people. Aiden. <coughs> Aiden Ross? Aiden McKay. Oh, Aiden from your podcast. Mm -hmm. Got it. Um, Freddie Mercury. Prezzo. You didn't even stream. <laughs> Fine. Tubbo. <laughs> Fuck. He sees my own trick against me. Mm -hmm. Um, gay person. Mm-hmm. There's, uh... See? The, no, no, the guy, with, the guy with the beard from Queer Eye. That doesn't count. You don't even know their name. Well, he's not from Queer Eye. Is that his name? Queer? Yeah, he's the guy with the beard. Guy with the beard from Carrera, that's the best. Yeah, he does do. hair. Wow. He does hair. You're describing that's homophobic. Why See? he does hair, that's what he does. Hold on, chat. What I'm trying to describe here is he can't name homo or um Hey, he do you wanna shake on this? I'll be homophobic. He can't name homos. I'll and be I can't name women, alright? I'll be homophobic if you're misogynistic. <laughs> <laughs> I mean that's a fair trade. That's a fair trade. That's a fair trade. I feel like you would get more heat because I'm an ally. It's worse. I'm an ally. I think being homophobic is worse than misogynistic. In this day Because I have a mother. That, why would that make it? Next oh. question. I would like to pick a duck. Okay, pick In a fact, duck. I think you've taken the last duck. Right, here we go. 10. 10? Number 10. Name 100 gay men. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I think he's better. Yeah. No, it's, that's what it says. <laughs> no. Name 100 gay men. Actually? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Wait, actually? It says name 100 gay men. What the f- we just tried this! You can't- Okay, name, name 100 gay men. Name 100 gay men. Come on. I can't do that. Yeah, you can. I don't even think I know 100 gay men. Yeah, because you're a homophobe. I don't think there's <laughs> as many gay men as women. You're saying there's no there's not 100 gay men in the world? What is the percentage of gays in the population of America? 90%. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe with the liberals if they ran it. That's right. <laughs> What, 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 trying to get what, what, what is the percentage of the gay population? Uh, I think it's hard to determine because there's Between a lot of six people. and twelve, right? Yeah, but there's people so many. It just keeps going up because people are finally, in, you know, coming to terms with it. I don't think that's with gay people. I think that's with 
trans people. Well, that it also, but also queer people, I think. But I think, well, I guess, yeah, because that's included. But I think yeah. I would say, what, 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 it's tech chat, you would know. Well, I, queer people, yes, yeah. queer people encompasses. I think yes. the gay population has remained relatively stagnant over the past 20 years, no? Are you saying we're not making enough gay people? I don't think <laughs> we're making any type of people, mm. but I think it's remained Are relatively. you saying being gay is a choice? I'm saying <laughs> if I were to choose. <laughs> Hi! It looks gross. I know. Does it really? Yeah, it looks like a bunch of junk food around a tub with two men. Did you just fart? No, it was my shorts. <laughs> We've been drinking. Yeah. Well, we're having a great time. You're in boy soup. Can just boys be boys? <laughs> men be men. Ludwig thinks I'm a misogynist. I Why? know he is. Because we did the name of the and he failed up. This is what you do. You do ping pong. Ready? Yeah, we did this. Well, uh, let me try it with Cutie. I think I need a woman. He brought it twice. No, okay, hold on. We just go in a circle, and then first... Yeah, let's go in a circle. That's okay, sure. That's better. Okay. Let's start with Cutie. Go ahead. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Um, Taylor Swift. Beyonce. Selena Gomez. Ariana Grande. <laughs> Margaret Thatcher. Miranda Cosgrove. Lena Dunham. Selena Gomez. No. That's what it said. Beyond a uh, Britney Spears. No, I, you can't do two. No, you failed. No, no, no. You no. failed. <laughs> All right. Bye, cutie. Bye, Bye, you. We'll see you in the tap soon. I want you, your final challenge, okay? The only one we have yet to do. Oh, God. No. If you, as a man with a podcast, sure. could add any person uh -huh. dead or alive to your podcast, who would it be? <sighs> to our podcast, dead or alive. They're a new guest. New to make guest. it good. To make it good. <laughs> Our podcast is already better. Than The Yard? Yeah. I mean, I want to be a guest on The Do Yard. Do you say that truthfully? No. I want to be a guest on The Yard. I think I think you should make a trade. Who would we get? You guys make more money than we do. Who would we get? You would get me. I wouldn't mind. You're the... Well, cutie, too much of a conflict of interest. If what does that mean? You don't want to mix business with, with your... I can understand that, right? So I think I'm the best person. Yeah, I think we, that's right. That you guys make more money. And so I think... I need to be traded with Aiden. You know what? And no one gives you this credit. You do a lot. You fly for every show. I do. That's a lot. It is. You know? But you know, Hassan doesn't give me a break. Hassan doesn't give me a break. He, you know what he does? What does he do? He goes, all right, uh, see you later stream. I'll uh, be live tomorrow at 10 a.m. Yep. for top of the news hour. And mm -hmm. then he walks over to another room. Yeah. And then he does it. Yeah. You fly. You don't, yeah. That's, I, that's. I get on a plane every single week. Sometimes Will's like, I don't want to drive there. Yeah. Drive! Yeah. You're flying! I fly a thousand miles. That's crazy. But you know what? Nobody gives me credit, and because I'm so humble, <laughs> <laughs> I never ask for it. Sorry, repeat that sentence? I am so humble. And you never ask for the credit. credit. I never ask for credit. That's so brave. I thank you. I never ask for credit. And you know what? Luckily, a lot of people don't know this. But I fly coach. No, you don't. I do. You don't have a lot of me. I do. You've never been behind the wing. I have been. <laughs> I don't be right. <laughs> that's the that's the difference. I do fly coach, but I haven't been behind. You're the not wing. behind the wing in a while. You're in front of the wing for sure. I, you're comfort plus. At least. Yeah. Come on. That's crazy. And maybe you get your free upgraded business. First. Uh, ooh. They, do they do first? On okay. Th this is my. Thing? This is what I. This is what I dictate whether I'm going to pay for first class. Okay. This is what I do. Yeah. If. There's a meal on the flight. I'll pay for first class. Oh, that's a, that's not a bad reason. I, that's what I do. I usually run a Southwest. Southwest. Yeah, I love Southwest. I love Southwest. And I. Pilots are well paid. Here's what I do. Very good pilots. Because I usually show up very late to the airport. Okay. So I, if I even had an A slot, I okay. missed it. Okay. But you know what happens? What happens? Aisle window, aisle window, aisle window. Okay. And the first five rows all have middles open, but people try to go to the end to get aisle window. Sure. I go to that middle on the fucking first five rows. Fuck yeah. I say, I say, hey, does anyone sit there? And, and you know they're doing the thing where they have the bag there? Yeah. I'm like, it's gonna fill up, buddy. Yeah. Move the fucking bag. Yeah. Let me sit my ass down. Yeah. And hey, by the way, I get both armrests. I'm in the middle. The last thing we're gonna do, Ludwig, yeah. to close out in the tub with Austin's show, is we, we have a great time. Huh? We've had a great time. No, this has been an awesome. Chad, you had a great time. You have a great time. Press Chat. Yeah. Chat if you had a great time. Keep I'm pressing one if you think Austin's misogynist. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Ludwig, because you know you have to tell me to stop because I'll keep going. Yep. But I got the hint. It's time to close up, Chat. Before we close up, every week we give you an opportunity to call into the show. We're putting the number on the screen, and today. We're going to be playing some voicemails. Every end of the show, I like to play the voicemails of our wonderful viewers who have called in. So let's play them. Here we go. Hi, Austin. I just have a question for you and everyone in the tub. Out of everyone in the tub, 
Who do you think is the best gamer and why? Oh, you. Why? Because you are you game. I don't game. You used to play RuneScape. That's like saying who in the tub can fly and like the other person's a bird. Hi, Austin. This is Tyler calling from Ontario, Canada. And I actually had a question specifically for you. Um, my question is, uh, could you and would you please uh, fuck the shit out of me? <laughs> <laughs> now, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a straight guy. Can I say them? I'm a straight man. <laughs> I knew immediately when Tyler started speaking. I don't have, I don't have the best gay on. Sure. Is Tyler gay? <laughs> I mean, potentially. They could be. Do, do you think in a sentence you could tell someone's straight or gay? I mean, in that instance, yes. I, uh, I have this friend uh, who actually recently got engaged, Zach. He's oh. my best friend growing up. Okay. Uh, and uh, he is, he's gay. Okay. And uh, Aiden, Wait, did he get engaged to a, a man? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you never know. Could be gay and not want to act on And he, uh, and Aiden, my, my, my friend Aiden, sure. hopped on a call and, and I was speaker. The one? Aiden McKay. Okay. And I said, and, and within the, the call ended, and he goes, is that gay? And I was like, how, how did you know? Oh. He knew instantly, how do you know? Sometimes I just know. It depends. It's really hard, and it it borders problematic trying to figure out if somebody's gay. It's part of the challenge with being a gay man in growing up in a in a honestly a traditionally homophobic society in which a lot of people the 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 default for a lot of people is have to hide for many decades. There's kind of like this built in like have to discover somebody being gay, and there's this there's this idea in our society that people may not tell you because of the construct of mm. sexuality in the society, right? So there's like this game, and it borderline's problematic because sexuality is a very personal thing for right. a lot of people. Right. So I, with all that in mind, I would say a lot of it is in the eyes. Not like people have gay eyes. They have gay eyes. But like it's a lot of it's how you look in terms of like. Not like how you look in terms of They life. look gay. You <laughs> I mean, in a way. Dude, when, when, okay, let me ask you this. Okay. When you were not openly gay. Sure. But gay. Yeah. Did people in your life confront you about being gay? No. No. The, well, they- Not one. I mean, they, they, after the fact, they were like, we knew, but it wasn't because of any actions. It was the lack of action with women. Like, they were like, Austin, come on. Like, you had, I had this beautiful apartment in college. And my brothers were like, dude, where's the pussy? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, where's the, where's the girls at? You were going to say bitches. I was going to say You held yourself. I did. Because I was afraid people would think I'm a massage. Because it's gendered language. It is gendered language. You should cut that out. I think women shouldn't be, I think men should be called bitches. Why? Because they're less... (laughs) (laughs) Next Next voicemail! Hey, welcome to the show. This is Kevin at findaswift.com, letting you know your description has expired. Make sure to sign back in if you're like your account renewed. Are you signed up for findatwink.com? Next voicemail, okay. Next voicemail. Hey, Austin. I'm gonna do a magic trick via voicemail. Uh, I want you to think of a number between 1 and 10. And your guests can also think of it. And chat too. Six. I'll give you a second. Okay. I hope you got it. Um, now times it by two. Twelve. And then subtract three. Uh, and then add four. Nine, seven, four, eight, okay. eleven. You got it? Thirteen, yeah. Cool. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> All right, okay. All right. Ludwig, it's been so nice to be in your tub. Austin, I hope you had a good time. I had a great time. This was awesome. We could have gone for hours more. I'm so happy that you didn't even care that I was farting in here. No. <laughs> I actually, it kind of made me uh, enjoy it more. Appreciate you. Thank you. Did you have a good time? Uh, an excellent time. Great. What do you think of the show? Do you like it better than Amy Prize? No. Okay. Great. Not close. Thank you so much for coming, Ludwig. You love the Amy Prize. You can find him everywhere on YouTube. His name is Ludwig. <laughs> 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 Which is a German name for the record. Uh, and he he's also a famous ruler. Yeah, he also owns a company where he treats his employees very poorly. Mogul Moves. That's true. That's true. <laughs> he has a show that's live tomorrow called uh, Intern. Unpaid. Unpaid Intern. It's live tomorrow. Go check it out to see who wins the show. Yep. Thank you guys so much for watching. Tomorrow we'll be live with Will Neff. Have a wonderful evening, everybody. Goodbye. Bye.